Lloyd's a little Take off the gloves and fight him. They'll fight him for that bullshit song you Connors, made. we have a date for the comeback yet. Who, who's the opponent? Look, Gregor! Okay, again, double pay and bonuses. Yo, Conor McGregor's walling. Check this out. So at BKFC after party, Conor McGregor is seen pulling a woman's hair towards him. Looks like he wants to dance. So his long-term fiance D gets between them and things get awkward. What's this about thinking? Then we got McGregor calling out Floyd Mayweather for a rematch. Floyd, you little you like you're doing bad co uh, conversations trying to get a boxing match at 155. Fight me my way. I'm the ace of it. You owe your self. Bare knuckle. McGregor Mayweather, 170 pounds. Let's go, baby. Take off the gloves and fight. <laughs> Floyd would never do bare knuckle. Imagine. You know, there is conversations ongoing. I fought Floyd at 153 pounds, which is a low weight for me. So he brought me all the way down. It was over 12 rounds. I'd never fought 12 rounds. So, you know, now the discussion is, is at my weight, higher, heavyweight, 170 pounds and maybe less rounds. So I would fancy it. I had him bent over. You see me, I had him bent over. So what more do you want me to do? <laughs> you want me to finish the job no. when I have him bent over? Do you need the second part with my weather? I don't need. I am so blessed by God. I don't need nothing. <laughs> what is his accent? <laughs> I don't need. I have. I have. But I like a fight. Then he goes in on KSI. You called out KSI a few times. Could we ever see that fight down the line? Let's go. Man. Any messages for KSI? I'll, I'll fight him for that bullshit song he released alone. <laughs> I'll fight him for that fucking song alone. He even had a few words for Ilya Taporia. I know Ilya Taporia has had a lot to say. <laughs> country. Yeah, and this isn't his home country. This is my home country, baby. My Bay of Spain, where's he at? This ain't his home country. He knows where his home country is. And it's not Espana. So, uh, good luck, Max Holloway. <laughs> up. I would say I would bet on Ilya Taporia, but he is not Spanish. He is Georgian. Let's be real. I am a Spanish, if not more Spanish than Ilya Tepuria, who is a Georgian man undercover. He is operating undercover. He also announced his next fight day and opponent. Connor, do we have a date for the comeback yet? February 4th, Saudi Arabia. Who, who's the opponent? <laughs> what? Is this real? We need confirmation. And he's also seen chopping it up with Dan Hooker that same night. <laughs> What does it mean? Who do you want to see kind of fight next? Floyd, KSI, Taporia, Hooker, someone else maybe? Let me know in the comments. And I think McGregor got a bit too excited for the build up to the main fight. And here for Connor McGregor! Which was an absolute war. Right hand to fucking Tanaglia. Not the big right hand. Right hand to Tanaglia. Which made Connor do this. Two of the people that fought on this card. But what we're going to do for these two gentlemen, as well as a bonus, is double the purse. They're getting double paid. That's L3. Well done, gentlemen. You're like getting double paid and bonuses. Thank you for your service. Absolute fucking warriors, guys. And he not only doubled their purses, he doubled down on the decision to do so. Tweeting, doubled their purses and happily. You put in a fight like that in the main event, the world is yours. Bravo, Franco Tanaglia and Tony Loco Soto. Vamos, España! And still, no one is safe. It seems like Conor McGregor's coming after Bruce Buffer. Hola, España! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Bare Knuckle Fighting Championship live from beautiful Marbella, Spain, and only on Dazon. Ladies and gentlemen, the Masi Caballeros, welcome to BKFC! And there you have it. Remember, swipe up and hit follow so you don't miss a thing. Peace!